Right, my very first Diamond Art Club unboxing and my very first Diamond Art Club um, paintings. I ordered two and they arrived this morning. I'd already opened the box because I'd already done started doing a um, an unboxing, but I only undid the box and got them out. But um, I changed my mind because everything was going wrong. I couldn't get the angle. My phone wasn't charging and I had to put it on charge and it was just being a nightmare. Um, and this angle is absolutely probably just as bad, but um, I don't quite know what else to do considering I've got two of them and they're quite big. Right. So the first one is a round and it is, can you see that? The Masarashi, oh God, Masarari Muse, the Masarari, Masarari, Masarari Muse, because I think that's a silent CH. Right, so that's one. And then my other one is quite heavy. And I'm there going, oh heck, what have I let myself in for? Because it is very heavy and it's quite big as well. And as you can tell, it's a square. And this one is Spirit of Flight. Oops, that way around. Josephine Wall. And that one, oh my word, I really can't wait to see that one. Now, I'm square. Now, I'm trying to figure out which one I should open first. Um, the Maserat, the Maserat, Mar, oh God. The Muse, I should start with calling her the Muse. This one I should probably open first and just so we get a, um, a bit of a contrast, I'll open up the cat's sleeping duvet, which she doesn't like. She's got tea stains all over it because I'm a messy drinker of tea in my bed. And now let's try and open it up without any scissors and only a fork in my pot. Oh, that's going to be good. Oh, no, tell a lie. I found a knife. I've got it open, but I just need to... A blunt knife. This one is a partial, apparently. Oh, my word. Do you know what? It's getting, getting a diamond painting in a box. Because usually they come in grey, grey envelope bag things from the other side of the world. <laughs> Gosh. Yep. Contentu, contenu du kit. Toile de bâche de valeur de quality superior. Yes. Fair dinkum. Gosh. Right. No. Every now and then I try to move that. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. I've got an old tool kit, sadly. Probably because it's an oldish painting. I had thought it was going to be one of those nice ones slightly bent sticker oh sorry and oh i love the feel of these bags the soft feel oh it's so nice and what you get in here is lots of baggies i don't like these baggies much because they're the cheapy ones and they're very flimsy i've got a nice load of them though so I'll either have to find a use for them or I'll have to, um, I don't know, give them to a nursery or something for them, I don't know, to put things in. And you get your blue pen. Quite stiff, actually. Actually, that's quite impressive. Oh, and look at the heart. The heart-shaped wax. Even though I'm now using glue dots, so I probably won't be using this. And one of these... Oh dear. Well, it's definitely not going anywhere, is it? Maybe I'll have to do it from that angle. 
That's the one thing about having a um a very flimsy pin is that you could easily get them on, but at the same point they'd easily fall off. But that ain't going anywhere. Perfect. And then an old boat, not one with a stopper, and a what placer is this? A four placer. So that's all that's in the um in the kit. It being around, I suppose that's probably why. But I was hoping for like one of those packs, you know, with the cover minders and and pots for your wax. But never mind. That's that, that's that. I'm hoping the sticker paper's in here. Gosh. Now this one is a, oh my word, I didn't realise it was so big. This one is a 41.7 inch by 27.6 inches, which in new money is 106 centimetres by 70 centimetres. So just over a metre. And oh, oh my God, that is absolutely, it's got 50 colours and one, two, three, no, one, two ABs. And oh my God, the feel of the canvas. Oh, wow. And it's so big. And I've gone and dropped the drills and guess what? I can't bend down to get them. <clears throat> because my back won't allow me. So, let's pick up the sheet. And also, I'll end up knocking you if I try. Luckily, this is the small bag. <laughs> Not from the other one. They're the drills. Tells you what it is. Oh, and I've got some special ones. Hmm. So, there's the... Be fair, that's not a very nice piece of um, sticker paper. It's a bit dull, you know, in comparison. If you can see, I don't know if you can see, but that is a lot whiter. But <coughs> they're going to be going on the pots. So you get your step-by-step -step instructions and your code. And, oh, that reminds me. If ever you get these before and you get two, um... I got a packing slip in the box, the big box, and when it fell out, I was about to bin it, and then I read down the bottom, for returning customers, use, and then there's a code for 15% off. So, off your next order. So, always double check and don't throw it away, because 15%. Oh, my God. It's a pity that this bit isn't drilling i didn't realize how big it was going to be but look at the canvas it's so glittery and shiny oh my word this is going to be a dream to work on and very very sticky poured glue oh my word let's get it up close if i can look at the colors Wow. So this is the drilling area. There's actually quite a lot of drilling bits. So actually, it's not as bad as I thought. Because I was expecting some partials just to be, you know, the odd smattering of those special rhinestone type um, thingamajigs. And then I wouldn't have been very impressed. So that's the painting. We can roll it that way because we can. Now the drills. This is the big thing. I've heard so much about these and hope that they, and of course it's round. I'm not really a roundish person, should we say. I am round physically, but not into, not diamond paintingly round. But oh my word, the colours. 
Now, we have to look at the black ones and they're, my word, that's the amount of black there is. Oh my gosh. Granted, we have a 939, but even so, that's the amount of 939 there is. Wow, I had thought there was a bit more than that. So if we look at the black drills, and let's see, I have to take my glasses off for of those, just to see, because it's the black ones that are usually the, um, the ones with more trash and more... I mean, there's a few with nubs on it. I'm not sure if you can see that or not. Whoops, where is it? Probably can't see it. There's a few with little nubs on. But not too bad. The rest are okay. Yep. They're all right. Oh, one for one. There's a rogue drill in that one, a rogue black. But look at the spangle, spangle, sparkly of that. And there should be one other. These colours are absolutely wonderful. I was toying up with doing this one last because I was uh, thinking, oh, I probably won't like it. And, Ugh. but I think I'm going to be doing this first. Oh, I love one first, of course. Nice. Oh, and it's a blue. Can you see that? Blue spangly. Wow. Very pretty. Now, I've heard that you don't particularly... Uh, see, I use glue dots, but I've heard that if you use glue dots on... Um, Aurora Borealis AB drills that it can take the coating, the sheen, you know, the um, the shiny, like holographic -y type sheen off of it. So that's why quite a lot of people use pretty places and things. So I might have to um, load up one of my wax, one of my waxes into one of my other pens and then put them on with that instead. But yes, so I should have done this. I'll pick up the others and go back through. I'm not sure if you can see or not. Should I put some light on? And then all of a sudden, oops, I'm not very good at this. I'm a bit cack handed. A lovely purple. And that. There you go, that's that one. Is that too tight? Oh no, that's my Aurora Borealis. 820 and 136. Trying to know which angle this um, camera's at. And these are the smaller ones. So next thing I've got to try and find out is um, when I'm going to start doing this, should I start it um, before I finish my other big one that I'm doing, my untamed version, Modao Zushi one, or should I get a bit of way ahead of myself and, and start it sooner? But then... I've got the next thing is what storage should I use? I mean, it's 50 colours and there's those Diamante style ones. A Y133. Yes. And they go, where do these go? Ah, they go. One, two, three. Um, oh, possibly there, 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 all along her diadem, crown thing. Yeah. <clears throat> Gosh. What storage, how much storage have I got that's available to be able to do? 
Oh, I don't know. I really don't know. Right, now the trick is get them all back in the bag. And it's a nice deep bag, so the rubbish will go in there well. That's one. Let's get him in before he disappears. I'm doing them in things of three. <laughs> Oops. There we go. That'll do. So that is the unboxing of the mass mass oh dear Maseraris Muse the Maseraris <laughs> sound like I've had a few drinks the Maseraris the, the mas, Maseraris Muse Diamond Art Club yes <laughs>